So we're here with avid cosplayer Carly Woods, but she's more than just a cosplayer. She's a Twitch partner. She does a lot of other things. What else do you want people to know that Carly Woods does? So I usually go by a digital content creator because I create content on a ton of different platforms. Um, I mean, Instagram is one of my like uh, places that I generate revenue. YouTube, um, Facebook, Twitch. Um, yeah, I do a lot of videos, a lot of travel vlogs, um, and I do when I'm at conventions. You know, I'm just making content. We film a bunch of videos. I do a lot of cosplay tutorials, things like that. And where have you traveled to recently? Um, well, I'm in Dallas right now. I'm from Toronto. Oh, this is I'm traveling. Oh, right. Yeah. Texas is traveling for some yeah. people. Yeah. Ugh. I'm actually from Sorry. Toronto. Oh, cool. Um, but I just Lovely. Went to Indianapolis. So oh, cool. I'm now American. I got my visa. She got your <laughs> visa. No, she's not. <laughs> Careful. We don't want the Canadian government just like breaking down your walls and being like, well, we got to take you back now, eh? But, um, God, I try to stay away from stereotypes whenever I'm, uh, you know, imitating yep. people. So. I, I am a very stereotypical Canadian. I are say, you really? I say big, I say about, I say... No, but you just said about. How do you say about? We say about. I like, don't know. I you said it right. When I say really? Yeah, when I oh my know. gosh, you've been an Indianapolis too long. <laughs> you know how to say about now. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah, my, my buddy, he's from Canada, his, his dad's from Canada, and he's p perfectly straight American accent, but until he says, oot na boot, yeah. and then that's when the Canadian comes out. Yeah. So you're living in Indiana, Indiana. Why is that so hard for me to say? I'm from Americas. I'm from the Americas. We got to just cut this out. Um, what drew you to Indy? Um, so my fiance is actually an IndyCar driver. Oh, so he was with a different team before and he just got transferred to Indy. So we're in IndyCar now and had to move for his work. Do you do any work with them in particular? Um, yeah, I actually do a lot of his social media. So anytime you see his like Instagram or Facebook, I do a lot of videos. I'm, I'm helping with that. So his, his feed is a lie. Like anytime he's like, this is me, I'm doing this. It's really you doing this. No, Rob does do his social media, but I definitely... Are you his PR agent too? Or you're like, no, Rob does it all, I swear. <laughs> no, no, no. He does do a lot. I help him with things. You want to give him a shout out so that people know who to follow? Robert Wickens. But really, it's Carly Woods. <laughs> we're, we're a couple together. We usually travel together. He's usually at the shows with me. And it's crazy because there's a really big crossover between cosplay and driving. And I had no idea until I started dating him. And... Most of the time, people come to my booth just to say hi to Rob. <laughs> That's so funny. Like, hey, Carly, good to like, see you. They like us together, but sure. like, they are very excited to see him. Well, you're like, you're like the cosplay indie car, you know, like dream power couple. Yeah, basically. I guess. <laughs> I guess. She's no, like, gotta, I know I am. got to get him in cosplay. He's never cosplayed before. Where is he right now? He's in Phoenix in a, during, sorry, he's in Phoenix at a race. Oh, cool, yeah, cool. Yeah, racing tonight. It's a night race. And so, uh, so... What's his first costume gonna be? Um, well, I think he looks like Eric from Little Mermaid, the prince, Prince Eric. So I was like, maybe damn it, Eric? he's super handsome, isn't he? Or Aladdin, or yo, Leanna, Leanna, what would Rob's first cosplay be? Uh, what's the character with his wig? Um, a Francine from Arthur. <laughs> So we have a guy who looks like a combination of Prince Eric, Prince. Aladdin, and Francine from Arthur. So Rob's very tanned, he has dark features, and I put my Velma wig on him once when we were drunk, and he looks like Francine from So he has cosplayed before, no. but in private. <laughs> this is getting weird. This is <laughs> Me neither. Me neither. But I didn't know that her we husband wore wigs do, or her fiance wore we wigs. We need to do a cosplay. I, there is something that I've told him I want him to do, but I can't remember. He really doesn't want to. He's not about that, but we'll, oh, we'll see. Oh, there it was. Oh, did I yeah, say that? Yeah, but, but yeah. Okay. It was good, though. It was very subtle. <laughs> enough you. to be exotic. Exotic. I'm, yes. I'm now exotic. <laughs> now exotic. exotic. Oh, my God. And, and Dallas, are you kidding me? Like, anything north of, of the panhandle, like, people are going to freak out. Yeah. Um, my girlfriend's from Turkey, and, and people can't even cope with it. Yeah. yeah. Um, so is there anything that you want the world to know about Carly Woods or Rob or the two of you together and, uh, and what the future holds for you guys? Um, well... I guess if you like to see behind the scenes of our life, do we do a lot of like... I'd love to. Like my Patreon and my content isn't just cosplay and stuff like that. Like if you guys are interested in Rob's life, we do Q&As about IndyCar and racing and there's a bunch of different stuff. Like my content is like my life and it's really cool that my 
community wants to support that and see that side of it. They don't want to just see cosplay. They want to see everything. So it's really cool. We're family. And putting your life under such an extreme microscope like yep. that. Challenges associated with that. It's what do very, you have? Very. Um, a lot of it is just like what to... When is the line drawn? What do you share and what do you don't share? Like when we got engaged, we waited a few days before we shared it because we didn't want to do it immediately. So it's just, it's just... What's that line for you? I don't know. You, you explore it. It's always a relationship with the line. Yeah. Walking it ever so... Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm starting to share a little bit more. Um, I actually was just diagnosed with alopecia, which mm -hmm. is um, an autoimmune disease where your hair falls out. And I didn't want to share that online. And then I was like, you know what? Leanna and I were talking and she was like, you, you should just do it. And I want to do more with my audience. And so we started doing that. And um, I've been doing some charity stuff. So I just want to like give back a little bit more. And Because people can tell when you're faking it. You know, like like people yeah. people can tell that but stuff. So whenever you bring down those, those barriers yeah. and you really show them who you are. Not, not so much the faking. It's just... Instagram and online is such a perfect world and people don't see really what happens and it's not fake Absolutely. It's just sharing more and so that's why I started sharing the alopecia stuff because I want people to know that our life isn't perfect and people go through struggles and, and I'm sure they tell you all the time like oh you just have the perfect life no, don't they it's very stressful and and once I did share that so many people were like I have it too and it's a very popular thing and it's cool that we can like be open and, and like fine with it and it's no big deal you know everyone yeah. goes through things I'd like to take this moment to come out and say that I'm not that tall. I'm pretty short. <laughs> yeah, I'm like 5'4", so. Yeah, so like, look at me. So you're <laughs> helping me. I'm giant, and you. And I'm another giant, haha. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, thank you so much, Carly. No this has been a lot of fun. went like a totally different way, but you know, we're good. Yeah, do you have any top fans that you want to give a shout out to? Anissa, who's hanging out here, and Ryan, who's going to come hang out too. He's from Dallas. These are my Dallas people. Oh, um, so you got Dallas people. I do got Dallas people. Um, Dallas was my first um, big show years and years ago, and I just love you guys here. Everyone's, it must be like the Southern hospitality, but everyone's really cool. So It is the Southern yeah. hospitality. We got that going for us. My, my Dallas people, so appreciate cool. you guys. Cool. Uh, anything else that we want to... Ask Carly about. This is very bad form just asking the camera person, like, are we good? Yeah. Thanks so much, Carly. We appreciate it. Best of luck to you. Thank you so much for watching that exclusive Inner Gamer interview. In order to watch more content from the expo, click right here. In order to subscribe, please do click right here. In order to like and share our video, please click down here because we like you guys so much. This is the Inner Gamer. Thanks so much for watching.